Hello, Cancer. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly love reading for October 2024. I know it's been a while, but um, I want to thank all of you for sticking with me. And yes, um, this month, because it's Libra season, or, you know, yes, yeah, it's still Libra season, so it's all about relationships. So, Cancer, this could be about your own love life. Or this could be the people you call your loved ones in your relationship, or it could even be a family member. So let's see, but this is a love reading. So let's start, okay? Let's see what's going to be your main energy in terms of, oh, this one has come down. We will take it, Cancer. We will take it. Let's see. Let's see what October holds for you, for your love life. Okay, we we'll take that one. Okay, now, let's see. I feel drawn to that one. And then that one. Let's see what happens. The bottom of the deck is the world. And then, okay, we've got nine of pentacles, which is like, this is taking control, being domineering. And um, let me quadruple check with this deck and um i think that is what it is um i've been reading this so much yeah it says dominion taking taking dominion so let's see let's see let's see hey hey the second card is ace of uh page of swords reversed and then four of pentacles so that is interesting cancer here it says taking um, control. So whatever you need to con take control of, I feel a cycle is coming to an end, to a fruition or a conclusion that, you know, now is the time for you to take control. Okay. In, in, in October, you are going to take control of anything that's coming to an end because number nine is also the ending number anyway. But I feel like from October, Whatever changes are, that are coming in, you are going to be able to take control, okay? The word is control and dominion over any situation with your love life or with people around you. And I feel here having this um, five of pentacles reversed here, anything that has been holding you back, yeah, that you felt out of control with your with the connection with the people around your, your love life or anything, I feel here you are going to be so relaxed, yeah? You know, you, you are not going to be living in fear of what people think about you, whether your, your partner is a foreigner, yeah? Because this is foreign. And also I feel like you are not going to be on your own. However, and if you've been, whatever people are thinking about you, can't you really don't care. I feel here... You are letting go of any fears, any fears that has been holding you back. And I feel here with this um, page of swords reversed, I feel that this is a reflection that you are going to be making in um, October. For some of you, it may have something to do with children. Or for some of you, it could be a decision you made that didn't really go well with your love life or someone can be um approaching you if you are single but if you are not single and you're in a relationship someone could be you know expressing their whatever decision they made that didn't go well because something is coming to an end something is finishing so it could also be that someone yeah that you lost confidence in yeah someone you lost confidence in in terms of relationship is coming back to make a confession and here i feel you are going to you will try and give them the benefit of the doubt because here you are covering whatever you've got and whatever your principles are you are holding on to it <laughs> dearly, dearly cancer you are definitely holding on to it and um they are going to come across as trustworthy if you are um already uh, if you are single if this is someone, I feel for most of you, it's going to be someone you already know. And um, if even it's relatives, okay, I feel you are still going to hold 
you are going to hold on to whatever your principles are. Okay. I don't feel this has too much to do with money. It has everything to do with your principles and who you are. Okay. It's like, I'm sticking to my guns kind of thing, because now you have the confidence you need. And yeah, I have to say, um, cancer, you have a lot of earth here. This is earth, earth, earth. Okay. This is also nine of pentacles. So earth, 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 earth. So I feel you may have strong, um, there may be something in your 11th or 10th house that has something to do with your love life. For example, your, your partner or whoever you are looking, it may have something to do with foreign issues. Um, that is also coming to a good fruition for you. But overall, I feel that um, this is looking good and your confidence is a lot of earth signs here. That's what I want to say. So whatever it is, um, this is going to be very concrete for you. So I hope this has been insightful for you, Cancer. I will leave the reading here. I will see you next month or you will see me next month.